Hello everyone, today we are doing our weekly tarot and angel card reading. I hope you're having a beautiful week. We're going to be running from Monday through to Sunday, all the way to July 2nd. So I believe this is uh, June 25th through to the 2nd, something along the lines of that. June 26th until July 2nd. So happy Canada Day to everyone this week. Starting a new month, some people say rabbit, rabbit, rabbit at the start of the month. I also do June readings as well, so of course I haven't gotten those out yet, but I will get those out as well, okay? So let's do a pick a card, one, two, or three. First of all, the devil is our um, weekly theme, all right? Please subscribe to this channel underneath my YouTube, Horseman Readings as well. It's really helpful for me. Uh, click the thumbs up button if you enjoyed these videos. I'm also on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. You can see my link tree and all my stuff through there. So this is talking about someone who's feeling blocked emotionally, um, maybe even creatively. So in general, what we have to pay attention to this week is breaking free of any uh, patterns or cycles that we're still feeling a little bit stuck or stubborn in. So emotionally, um, what can you do? More heart openers, things like that. Uh, you can look up what a heart opener is in yoga or meditation. It's essentially just opening up this chest a bit more, dropping the shoulders, just noticing any physical tension that you're feeling in your body. And then emotionally, that will be helpful. So releasing... Um, any heart chakra blocks that are coming up for you. Okay, so if you're picking card number one here, energetically, whichever you feel most drawn towards, we have burden. So this does say that the weight will be gone. You will emotionally feel like things are leaving. The stress is going to be reduced. This is actually gonna come up closer to midweek where you're, I think you're gonna have like a little moment where you're like, oh, okay, I can breathe, that sort of thing. If you're drawn towards card number two, we've got the moon. This is still talking about a little bit of fear and anxieties. I'm getting to focus more on your hopes and your dreams. Um, astronomy is also coming up. So looking at uh, your signs a bit more, you might find that that's helpful. If you're picking card number three, we have nine of pentacles. This really talks about uh, you working on your self-love practices, journaling, um, maybe sharing more about your story, um, maybe like about your past traumas, things like that to inspire other people. Um, I feel like talk about yourself a little bit more if you're drawn towards card number three. In general, what I get this week is it's going to be a really great time for you to initiate big moves, big changes uh, towards working towards your bigger dreams. Um, it does feel like, again, these patterns of behaviors are going to be coming up a lot just so you can look at them a bit more and just trust that you're being shown stuff so that you can be more creative, that sort of thing. So these blocks are, are coming up so you can remove them, okay? So if you want to, you can book in a reading with me. They're only $55. I do that through email, phone, or through Zoom, whichever way you prefer. You can book online through Horseman Reading dot com where you can uh, give me a quick message and I can set something up for you. All of my readings are um, 30 minutes and uh, a big thing is that we go into your Akashic records, we pull up cards um, or we do sometimes like a chakra scan. I will often do theta healing downloads which is a, a way to release old patterns of behaviors, shift it over to things that uh, you would like to vibrate as well um, and I do a lot of different um, healing tools as well I offer um, tools that I feel like will help you move forward as well with some of the stress or with some of that self-love, okay? Um, but continue to work on your passions this week. Your dreams um, also can be solutions to problems, so that intuition is going to have to be uh, quite in tune this week. So make sure you're taking really great care of your health. All right, love you guys, and bye for now.